are live. Welcome to Glamo's Closet, guys. Hi, everyone. Welcome to Glamour's Closet. Um, I am here with another Thread Up Fun Box unboxing. This one's a little special. Here's why. Here's, here's why. Okay, so uh, I hear my dog set up barking. I ordered two Fun Boxes, have gotten one so far. One. Um, this is the one that arrived today. And this is the state that my Fun Box arrived in. Uh, here's the bottom, which is not connected, and there was a chain of some sort hanging out. Um, here's the side, and you better believe I photographed and videotaped all of that. Here's the front. Here's the other side, and yeah, and 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 here is the oh god. It's at legitimately falling apart. Like it is falling apart. Something has a chain in here. Hopefully it's not broken. So this was, this came to me from Phoenix, Arizona. Uh, apparently by way of the, um, uh, uh, of the, I don't know. Uh, I can't even think of something that would destroy a box this badly. Maybe they dropped it off at the St. Louis Zoo in the in the gorilla cage and just let that happen. Somebody tried to murder my box, y'all. Somebody tried to kill my fun. We don't allow fun killers to kill our fun. So hopefully, uh, yeah, thread up RIP thread up box. This box is going directly into the recycler um, or the burn pile. Hi, Asia Dancer. Hi, Kristen. It's good to see you. Um, so yeah, we, it, it came to me by, uh, by, via from Arizona, I should say, not via, not via, but from, uh, and, um, it is a fun box. Still got the, the stuff, I guess, uh, it was one fun box. The cost on this box was $34. Plus uh, shipping, I think it was actually uh, $44. So uh, that would be, if it's 10 items, it's about $440 per item. Uh, yeah, handle with care, right, Jackson? Handled with care by the good people at USPS. <laughs> what in the world? Why were they, what are, what are they so angry about my fun box? <laughs> Why are they so mad at my fun box? Uh, hi, Robin. It's good to see you. Who tried to murder my box? I don't know. The mystery still remains. It's unsolved, but somebody tried to murder my poor fun box. So um, I hope it's a good one. A little traumatic at the beginning, but we'll hold on. Okay, so the first thing out is uh, Banana Republic Women's Tight, size medium, large. It still has the original tag on it for $14.99, so I'm not mad about that. Um, and I don't know if these are regular tight. They look like they're like a herringbone sort of print, like an up and down herringbone. Um, I don't know if I can stretch that out enough for you to see, but can you see that? It's like a little herringbone stripes. So those are kind of cute. I like those. Not mad at those. That's one. You know we're you know we're counting these. Um, the second thing is, oh, Disney Mickey Cozy two piece pajama set, size small. And uh, it's got, again, it's new with the tags. It's got the original Disney tag on it. Um, and look at those. They're cute, actually. They've got, like, the Mickey Mouse head like that, the little mouse ears. And they're gray, and they feel soft. Um, and they are a small, so uh, those, will probably, those will probably go for sale on Oshmark. Um, this is a Bally bra size 36B, and it almost looks like kind of a, it almost looks like a nursing bra, but it's not. I don't think. I think it's just a Bally bra. Yeah. 
originally $39. Um, and it's new with the tags, which I like. But it's very kind of a just a normal sort of bra bra. No underwires. Um, just sort of a basic white bra. But, you know, who can't use a basic white bra? So that'll go on Posh as well. Let's see what you are. Okay. Somebody's going to have to tell me if this is a good thing or not. Uh, I, I suspect it's neither or it's an AirPods silicone case cover by Delia. Anti-shock, anti-lost key ring. I just, I really find that cute. And I think that would be a cute giveaway item. It's got a heart on it. So I'll probably make that one of the giveaway items on the um, classic crap auction. I think that would be cute. Just a little AirPods silicone case cover. You know, just tooling around. So that's nice to have a, a free giveaway item. Hey, Christopher Nutter, how you doing? Mwah, good to see you. Raquel, hello, gorgeous. Mwah, it's good to see you. And everybody's saying hi to everybody else. I love that. Yeah, Jackson, uh, Handle with care by the good folks at USPS. Just one, two, three items so far, four items. So it, we have the uh, the tights, the pajamas, the bra, and the air pod set. So that's four items. Um, and now we have this. Whoa, let's turn our attention to this girl. Hello, who are you? Okay, she just a big, she's a big old scarf is what she is. Um, I don't see any tags so far. Maybe there's a tag on here. I don't see one. I don't know. I do like it generally as a scarf. Um, but also I, I, as a tablecloth, to be honest, I, I think it'd be kind of a cute little tablecloth. Yeah, there's a very good chance. There's like a 100% chance that if I don't sell this, I'll use it as a tablecloth. Um, so that is number five, and that's cute. Oh, hello. Hello, lover. Oh, my God, it's not broken. This is effing awesome. <laughs> I love her. There's no name on her. No name. Uh, but now I know where that chain came from. Check this out, guys. You can even see it sparkle from there. Ooh. And it's got a little chain. And these are all, they're like removable carabiner, the little chain is. Um, the big chain looks like you would just stick it, I guess you would stick it down on the thing. Um, but it's also got a big chain for a crossbody. I love her. I don't know if I'll give her up. I might, I might keep her. I really like her. Yeah, I really like her. Hey, Dodo. Hi. Stupid keyboard. Hi. Oh, no. Is it doing that tea thing again? Hi, Kristen. Aw. I like this, guys. I really like this. And let's see. I don't think I saw anything major on the inside. It's just kind of a... Just kind of a heart purse, you know, just kind of a, like, literally, I, I don't even think my cell phone would fit in this. Um, but if I'm going someplace fancy enough to wear this, who wants to bring their cell phone in that? Yeah, it does, Robin. It does. It feels like a glamour thing, I got to tell you. <laughs> it feels very, and I am, uh, we do have a cruise plan for this year or so. Just saying. Okay, and there's a belt, um, and it's got the little tag on it, so I'm wondering whose belt this is. Is there a name? Oh, it's Michael Kors. Okay, so it's got a black tag on it. Can somebody tell me from ThreadUp if the black tag, does that mean it's not authenticated? Or it is? I mean, it is, like, pretty Michael Kors design. It's a, it's a thinner belt, too, so I don't feel like there would be a lot of... Um, I don't feel like there would be a lot of call for counterfeiting something like this. I really don't. But I think it's very cute. It's a it's a thinner belt, so I think this is gonna this is going to uh, sell well. 
I, that's cute. That is cute. I don't wear thinner belts. I don't wear belts at all. I just, I'm thicker in the middle. And then that. Um, okay. Oh, here's another little cute purse. Ooh, I kind of like this guy too. Who is that? That's got somebody's name on it. Hold please. Do, 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 do. Yeah, I think this is just kind of the standard markings for it. Okay, but but check it out. <laughs> how cute. She's like a little velvet purse. Look at how cute the little bottom is, too. It's like a little square bottom, and it's poofy. And then she's got, um, apparently, she's got a crossbody strap, if you like. So that's cute, and it's like a velvet. It's velvet. And it's an adjustable crossbody velvet strap. And there's no name brand on this, but I feel like it would sell itself through style alone. It's got an interior pocket, um, big enough to actually put a cell phone um, and uh, something like that. I, how cute. How absolutely adorable. This is really cute. Okay, I'm pretty happy with this fun box, despite the fact that it came to me just absolutely busted. Oh, some more of these. I keep getting these generic giant sunglasses that are just kind of hideous. They're just flat and cheap. And I feel like somebody picked them up for like a thousand for like two bucks at the Goodwill or something. And they're scratched. So there's that added feature. And made in China. Ooh. It's not my style. Frankly, they're ginormous on me, and they're just, it's just not my thing. Sleepy, night, night, yeah. This one just, oh, no thanks. Okay, well, you, you know, not everything can be a home run. Uh, not my favorite, but um, what I find, too, is that with the fun boxes, it's a great way for me to... Like I have like little things that I can just snatch and grab, you know, from the fun boxes um, as giveaway items and as, um, as you know, like if, if I find out it's somebody's birthday or something like that, it's always kind of nice to have a few little things that are new with tags that I can grab. Uh, takes away the need to go shopping, I think. Okay, if this isn't Brighton, I don't know what is. It, I'm just going to say this. It looks like Brighton. I don't know that that's the truth, but it very much looks like Brighton. Oh. And it's got a marking on it, so of course I'm going to have to look that up. But doesn't this look like Brighton, guys? All of this? Like all of the thick little hearts and the swirls and the twirls, the swirly twirly gumdrops. Now I have a Brighton, um, I have a Brighton like case that I think it would be really cute in. So if it is Brighton, it would it's gonna be perfect for that. Let's see. Boy, they. Okay, so that's upside down. Better I should read it right side up, I guess. Taiwan, that does not help. Okay, the other side has, has a larger logo. It is definitely Brighton, kids. Awesome. Okay, so that's Brighton. And that is a very good thing. So that is very sellable, cute cute little keychain with all the little bobs, the thing of a bobs on it. And it's even got like a little carabiner. I like this. Okay. So that was, that was 10. Literally once I took everything out, the box 
split in half. Oh, thread up. And I don't even know if that's thread up's fault. That could be that could be either crappy packing or U USPS. Okay, so we have the Brighton. That's one. The ugly sunglasses. Let's just call them what they are. They're ugly sunglasses. They're two. Um, the two bags, three and four, plus the Michael Kors belt, that's five. Uh, the This tablecloth slash scarf, that's six. Um, AirPods silicone, that's seven. With the bra, that's eight. And with the Disney, that's nine. And with the tights, that's 10. So I did get 10 items. I don't think anything's really missing other than somebody who actually loves giant, ugly sunglasses um, to buy those. No, I'll give those away. Those are, those are donations. Um, but I'm really happy with, I'm actually really happy with this. But I'm shocked that I'm this happy with this box and that there's nothing major missing that I can see. I love the fact of the Disney pajamas. You can sell Disney fairly easily. Um, if somebody's headed to like Disneyland or on a Disney cruise or something like that, um, the Banana Republic tights, the bra, the Bally bra, I think those will sell. Um, they'll probably sit for a little while, but they'll sell. This is adorable. That is magically adorable. And I'm contemplating putting that, both this and the other purse in my closets, but that one seems like a seller. This one I think would sell. But there's no reason for it to sell. There's no reason. I mean, look, it's got the little, my God, that's a little hard on top. And you just push it and then it opens and it's like this clamshell. I'm keeping it. I'm keeping my baby. Yeah, it's my baby now. This is going with me. Maybe someday I'll sell her, but not for now. Not for now. Um, but I also have the Brighton keychain. And I have the perfect bag for that, or the perfect box for that. I just need to add the keychain. And then the Michael Kors belt. And again, does anybody know what this means? A zip tie? I don't know, but it is a cute belt. It is a very cute belt. And very sellable. So all in all, I think, honestly, I think that was a really good box. And color me shocked. I am truly, truly, <laughs> I'm just shocked about that. I'm like, really? Really? They didn't kick the crap out of the stuff inside just the box? I'll take it any day, any day. Um, yeah, they did good. For 44 bucks. that was a really good mystery box. Um, I, I, and it was very much fun. Um, and even making fun of the, of the box itself was fun. That was kind of fun. Um, cause you know, normally I don't get to, I, I don't get to poke fun at, at the, uh, at the United States postal service. They always do everything so perfectly. <laughs> I can't barely finish that sentence. That's so funny, but no, they, they honestly, I, I just, I don't know. Maybe it fell off the back of a truck. Who knows? Who knows? But, um, I hope you enjoyed the opening. Hey, Hall, Hall, Holly, Holly, you got to see this. Sorry guys, but Holly's my friend. Holly, you got to see this. Check this out. Okay. First of all, the box was great. The box was great. Um, and check this out. This is going on the cruise with me. Oh, honey, look at this. Can you imagine? <gasps> And I have a uh, I have a black jumpsuit that comes off the off the shoulders, and it's got this rhinestone sort of pattern coming off of it for for dress up night. Are you kidding me? It's a wide legged jump jumpsuit, and it's got like the little thing that comes. Out. So cute! And with this, oh, I'm gonna be killing it. Sorry, I had to go a little fierce, but that's my Ola. That's my buddy. Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, and, um, and, and I'm just so darn blown away that I actually got something to do. Holly, I got a Michael Kors belt and Disney pajamas that are brand new size small. So if your niece is, is still in love with Disney, let me know. Um, 
and then a Brighton keychain and a new Bally bra. I got some really great stuff. I'm really, really happy. So, um, yeah, I am going to jump off here and, uh, you'll see me when the next thread up fun box comes in. Um, you know what, if they're going to tear it, tear up the box and leave me the good stuff, that works for me. Um, so hopefully all of your boxes come intact. Uh, but if they don't come intact, I hope that they come full of fun surprises like this one did. And uh, in the meantime, no matter who's killing your box, yes, I said that with a straight face. <laughs> no matter where you go and what, what kind of fun things that you open, I hope, <laughs> oh, I hope that I hope that no matter what you do, that you please keep with you and know and let it keep you warm in the colder days. Glamour does love you. I have a great night. Bye-bye.